We want the, the viewer, listener, the person that's there in the room to feel like they're going on a trip, you know what I'm saying? And if the music got them there sonically, then visually, they're going to be in a trance. Okay. Fat ground plus big boy equals big grams, the unsnortable. <laughs> Make some motherfucking noise. We wanted to make it different, you know, because this isn't Fanagram and this isn't Big Boy. It's Big Grams. You know, it's our second show, so it's, it's a growing process. There's just a really cool area that we can experiment, not just musically, but visually. And everything that's happening behind us is extremely psychedelic. This is what's going out, set up for big grams. This rack and all the cases here. What we've built is an interactive human motion driven video synthesizer using a rapid prototyping tool, touch designer, and representing you as a digital avatar, if you will. Three screens, one for each band member, using the Kinect camera to generate human motion scenes. There's some skeleton tracking going on, hand tracking. You know, you can create some interesting effects with arms and then ducking down and then moving back and turns into very abstract geometry. And then it does that automatically when it tracks you, when you step out of frame. It's tracking, it's tracking, oh, he's gone, and then it goes completely abstract. And then when you come back, it picks you up and then it snaps back in on you and centers you. A big part of this show is gonna be the visual performer and the musician learning to perform together and seeing how that evolves with what the dynamic is. We had to ship all of our equipment, our media servers, all the way from LA. 700 pounds. Yeah, 700 pounds of goodness. Yeah. Instead of using projection, it's a lot easier to use LED panels just because of brightness, so you're not fighting with the lights, which is always a big problem. All of our video output will go from this right into this great rack, and then from there, go onto stage and then go onto these LED screens. We're looking good. Yeah, you got power? Yep. Looks like good. The Xbox Connect is a device that's used for home entertainment. It's for tracking people's movement, and we're bringing it to a stage that tracks for entertainment for thousands of people. It's all according to motion, so every show is going to be different. There's nothing's there that you stand in front of it and it's just like, yeah! <laughs> and then the, the screen just comes up like that. The styles you're going to see tonight are going to be about 12 different looks that we've custom made, and they're all unique and independently different. There's some that are like all black and white that are real angular, that oh, look yeah, real yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. three-dimensional constellations, that's dope too. Fell in the sun is that our bodies are burning, which is super dark. It looks kind of like some almost like futuristic shit from the 80s, like a David Cronenberg thing, or like yeah, Tron. Yeah, yeah. That could be uh, just super entertaining, and it's also a psychological thing, you know, like brings everything even more to life. Our writing process has been very visual. We would put on all these, these old like psychedelic cartoons in the background and write music together. So we wanted to work with these guys on making a new experience for our, our audience. It's very difficult to use a traditional show for them. We have some very big, powerful characters here. We're basically taking the performers and enhancing them and adding effects based upon what they're doing. Uh, 
I'm gonna be operating multiple parameters. I'm gonna be choosing what effects come up, when they come up, the intensity of them, which screen is gonna be on. You can zoom in, you can zoom out, and actual 2D elements are coming 3D in real time. So there's a multitude of things that are going on, and it's not a very set script. I find that just flowing with the moment is like a very exciting and powerful thing. And then you can connect with an artist and have really great moments. You gotta depend on other people to understand your vision. I don't know how to set up a camera and set up my computer and like, they're all doing it in code, but it's visual and, and it's, the, it's their art. Totally, I mean, it's all, it's all a collaboration. I feel like you're burning up, like you might have fallen in the sun. Technology is moving so fast, and to be able to just maintain that and always be one step ahead, it defines us as artists. Thank you. Thank you.